Your customers love you, so obviously you'll want to share just how much they love you with any potential new customers, right? So you ask the customers who love you if they'd mind writing you a review on Google. Sure, they say. Do they do it? So you remind them, hey, don't forget their review on Google. Now what? Well, do you know what? I've got a better way. A way that you'll actually get a review, but not only that, the best reviews you've ever had and ones that your customers will respond to for years to come. Reviews, testimonials, call them whatever you like, but they're a brilliant way of generating new business. That is, of course, if you can get them in the first place, if you can get them in front of the right people, and if those people reading them don't think they're fake and have just been written by some random computer in a server somewhere. Oh, and they've got to be good reviews too. This is not a good review. What you really want is depth. You want feeling, you want passion. You want to be able to see the person giving that review because if they're like you, then you might take them more seriously. Now, to get the best reviews ever, all you need is one of these. When you ask someone to rave about you on a video and you do it in the right way, you get something you don't normally get on a Google review. You get emotion. You can hear it in the way they speak and you can see it in their body language too. It might take a little more effort, but it's so worth it. Now, there are four ways you can do this. Now, this is the easiest option, but there's no telling what you're going to get back if you get anything back at all. There's a big chance they're going to be pretty uncomfortable talking in front of a camera or at least not very confident, and there's an even bigger chance they'll know naff all about camera technique, naff all about lighting, and naff all about sound. Basically everything you need to get a great review video. So let's move on to option two. Now this is better because if you know what you're doing, you'll get a better video, and of course you've got the opportunity to ask all the right questions, which means you'll get all the right answers. But that all does depend on you being better at using this thing than they are, and you've still got those camera nerves to contend with. If they look like they're about to be hit by a train, it doesn't matter how big they big you up, all we're gonna see is someone squirming in a chair. So let's move on to option three. Now, video makers come in lots of shapes and sizes, and what we really don't want is someone who's great at using a camera, and that's it, because we've still got that nervous reviewer to contend with, and it doesn't matter how cinematic it looks, we're basically back to that person in front of a train, just in better quality. What you really need is option four. What you really need is someone who can direct as well as film the review. Someone who's experienced in helping your reviewer feel confident and comfortable and relaxed on camera. Someone who can ask the right questions and in the right way too. And if you get all of that, you're gonna get a polished video from someone who's relaxed and comfortable and confident on screen and sharing all the emotion that'll really connect with your customers. And one of the really great ways of doing this is to do it all in bulk. Invite a bunch of your favorite clients over for like coffee and biscuits or whatever it might be. Make it super fun, get them nice and relaxed and then film them all at once and you'll get some really great results. Now I can teach you how to do all this for sure, but bear in mind it does take time and experience to be able to do this stuff really well and make it work. Ultimately though, if you want your reviews to actually generate income, you've got to go the extra mile now. People are far less trusting of written reviews and they all lack that key ingredient that can help your phone to ring and that's emotion. If you want to find out more about making review videos, you want my help making them, or you want me to pop around and make them for you, then pick up the phone, let's have a chat, you and me, speak soon. Bye.